And we are tracking developments in our Nashville 2022 reports. And right now, a developer wants to turn a historic church in East Nashville into a hotel and event venue. But some neighbors, they aren't on board. They want to see the church repaired, but not for this. Tori Gessner explains why. This is the building in question. It used to house Tulip Street United Methodist Church. Investment group Anchor Investments bought it in 2018 for $2 million. The group says they have big plans for the space, but people who live here worry those plans might change the neighborhood. Sitting tall on Russell Street, a staple in the Edgefield neighborhood. Also sitting empty. Development group Anchor Investments sees it as an opportunity for a hotel and venue space. People who live here see that as an attack. As a neighborhood, we feel that we're under siege. Peter Greaves sits on the Neighborhood Association's Development Board, tracking plans like the one for the old Tulip Street United Methodist Church. He says their Metro Council representative supports the plan, but neighbors are worried the venue part would bring more traffic and noise, holding up to 600 people inside. According to Greaves, there are no set plans for designated parking yet. Plus, neighbors would rarely, if ever, use the building themselves. There are going to be weddings from people living out of town, Brentwood, uh, corporate events that really do not benefit the community. I guess the other question is, where does it stop? A few blocks away on the same street, another Anchor Investments property. The group turned this old church into a hotel called the Russell in 2019. It has designated parking. Neighbors feel it still caused more traffic when people are picked up and dropped off in ride shares. But developers say they have plans in place to prevent that. It's been a struggle to work with um, proposed development, which we which we accept, but also how do we maintain our little neighborhood? A historic neighborhood filled with opportunity for developers and filled with people worried their home could become a parking lot. They do not want the event center. They feel it's an encroachment on the community that is unwelcome and they do not support it. In Nashville, Tori Gessner, News 2. Well, Anchor Investments hopes to urge, or I should say hopes to use, 41 public parking spaces and events for the hotel. Additional event spots will be offered at the Nashville Church of Nazarene across the street. Those plans are still, though, in the works.